Hey I'm Andy, this is the demo for Mirage Feathers and I'm recording this during the Steam Next Fest event and I'll link to the Steam page in the description down below for those that are interested. And yeah, I saw this on Steam and it says it's a pseudo 3D rail shooter and I, I like shoot 'em ups I'm not that great at them, but I do like to play them and there hasn't been a lot of on-rail shooters like this that I've seen. I mean, there, there are some, but it's usually all the shoot 'em ups I've seen are usually top down or like left to right. So seeing one like this piqued my interest. So yeah, let's just get started and I guess we'll do the tutorial. I am using a controller since Steam suggested I use one. So you can also use mouse and keyboard. Oh, that is very twitchy. <laughs> So we got chain gun, main weapon. Although main weapon's not really good. Maybe I should use the mouse and keyboard. Or maybe just like not be not move all the way. Is it very I need to change the maybe I need to change the sensitivity, right? Maybe I'll go like that. I think that's better. A little bit. <laughs> Alright, so we can shoot. Uh, the right trigger doesn't seem to be shooting though. Like, I'm, I'm shooting with a chain gun. But I don't know what the main weapon on the right side means. Also like, I, 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 said, this, I said this bro, I'm not, I'm not good with these types of and Considering that I haven't played a lot of these. Uh, it's... Yeah it is what it is. I, I think the most notable one would be... That I played. Would, would, you, would Star Fox 64 count as one of these? I mean, it has elements of this, but I don't know if it's a pure on rail shooter or not. Let's switch weapon. Ooh! How do we shoot with the right though? It's, it's, it's not. It's not shooting. I, I'm, I'm hitting the right trigger, but it's not shooting. That's weird. So we can, apparently we can dodge, maybe? So that removes the HUD. Okay, so overdrive works. The dodge doesn't seem to be working. Maybe I need to reconnect my controller, so let's see. Let's see if that works, right? So we're gonna pause and unplug the controller. Controller is this gonna yep, there we go. This work. I think I, I hope I hope it works. <laughs> so I can continue. It's it's still not shooting. So all main weapons can only I mean, uh, I mean, this is the demo, so there, there might be bugs. Maybe it's not main weapon. So click to rewind this key. Please press the key. So right trigger does work. So maybe there's a bug. I don't know. <laughs> maybe, I, maybe I just can't do it in here, right? Maybe in the real game it'll show because because the chain gun works. And switching the weapon seems to be working, but... Well, I mean, you can see the HUD change, it's just not changing. Hmm. So the overall enhancement, using missiles or chain yellow can recover energy, which is important. Well, I can use chain gun, then I can use overdrive just fine. I don't know what. Oh, I does dodge. Oh, I see the dodge. It's dodge is finicky. <laughs> okay, but I, I still don't know what the main. I still don't know what the main weapon does. I mean, I, I guess we will see if it works in the story mode. Sure. So, story mode. Let's go with medium. Because everything else seems to be working fine. 
change in the works. Will the right trigger work this time? Greetings and welcome to Mirage Feathers Demo. I'm Luciola, Notari's assi assistant, and I'm also an AI. So we skip the prologue and jump straight into this. I mean, it is a demo. Oh, well, this demo is meant to showcase combat gameplay. We pick up the story in media res to reduce spoilers. I mean, that, that makes sense. Here we start at the point after beating the first boss. I expect some difficulty in gameplay. At least there's a warning for it, right? However, that's when Notari gets her second main weapon. And now you can hit the ground running, so to speak. This demo is the combat experience distilled. If you want to take a sneak peek at the story, there will be a little bit towards the end. And now, without further ado, let's start. Okay. Will, will it work, though? Hunter Plasma Cannon obtained, so I can shoot that. Stage 4. Alright. Ooh. I'm getting the hang of this. I think. Kind of. I, I, I still don't... Maybe we need to pick up a main weapon. Because we picked up the cannon, right? Which, which I'm shooting right now. Aiming is hard with the controller. They, like I, I feel like I'm more. I feel like I'll have a better shot with the keyboard and mouse. So maybe, maybe I'll try that. But then the like the the key configs are just weird. I put myself on the option. If I'm in the like the configure menu, in the menu. I'm not good at this. I'm not actually. <laughs> Oh, that's a lot of bullets. I mean, art-wise, it looks fine. It plays fine. I'm just bad at this. <laughs> Alright. So, I see there's credits. So, we have, we have overdrive charges that we can use, but... So I, I feel like I want to move and aim separately. Maybe maybe that's what's the that's what how or that's what the mouse keyboard can do. Maybe caution! I'm getting hit from everywhere. <laughs> the music's nice though. <laughs> I don't know if I'm doing better. Oh, that's a lot of stuff. Barely beat it. <laughs> I don't know if you can call that beating it, but... I mean, it, it, I, it did warn me, saying the difficulty will be... hard. Alright, so... I'm just... mad at this. So, I mean, once, once we die, I'm gonna just go back... Apparently we can like switch UI too, right? But it's not shooting the main weapon. I don't know what the deal is with that. That that was even in the tutorial. So maybe if I try it with the mouse and keyboard, it will work. So okay, let's just go back to the main menu. Actually, I want to get this like a fair shot, right? <laughs> If it's just buggy because of my controller, then... Is that the game? Like, I, I mean, yes, to an extent, but... I'm just gonna disconnect my controller for a bit. Wonder if it's going to... Yep, oh, yep. So I disconnected my controller, so that should be fine. You can see my mouse. So let's see... The... Controls... Main weapon... So we have move is the was the main weapon one two three mouse weapon mouse gun change weapon. So there's also bullet time, but only if I mean there are cheats. But let's start a new story and see if we can do this with mouse and keyboard. Okay, I can want to see how it work, but let's see how it works. <laughs> I, I don't know yet because I haven't tried it. <laughs> Alright, so it's, I mean, it 
feels better for me because it, I mean I do like first person shooters with mouse and keyboard more than controller. I know that's personal preference and all that, but that's just my personal preference. So let's just skip all this. Will this shoot? So it is shooting. Was, was it? Okay, so so was it? So we can. Oh, moving with the keyboard is very finicky though. But shooting with the missiles. At least they're homing. So, so I can also move the mouse to an extent. Space is overdrive. Because I, I didn't see this happening when I was. Or maybe I was blind. I didn't see this happening when I was using a controller. Otherwise, uh, I feel like it would have been a lot easier. <laughs> I didn't even see it. I forget what, what was dodge. Ooh. Oh, I got hit still. So let's switch to this one. Yeah, I, I, I definitely would have seen this. I definitely would have seen this <laughs> if it was working with the controller. Ow. <laughs> so that's a shame. I don't know, like, like I said, I don't know if that's just my controller because... It is not a 360, but it's a gilly kit. All right, so we can't over, we can't just spam this because it does take up that blue. It's like it's a balancing game where you want to use this, I guess, for the most part, but then it does drain your blue bar. All right. And then we need to switch back to the missiles to actually recharge that. So, can we shoot both at the same time? We can't shoot both at the same time. Yeah, I don't know why it wasn't working last time. That's so weird. I mean, the only thing I didn't try was restarting the game, so... Maybe that might have fixed it. Yeah, it's, it's pretty fun. All things like the controller trigger not working on the side, it's still pretty fun. Oh, I, I didn't I didn't see the dodge button for the keyboard, so that's... E? No, it's not E. Space is overdrive. And Wasa just moves me with my, my character just all around. So, yeah. I don't think I'm just gonna leave this here, just because... I mean, what? Am I on the leaderboard? I am on the leaderboard. Oh well. Uh, let's see... It's, it's, it's interesting we can't type... We can't just type, like, I'm, I'm on the keyboard and we're just moving the letters one by one, so... Let's go with A. It, like, it, it's fun, don't get me wrong, like, it's fun, but I'm just terrible at it. <laughs> I, I'm sure with... If I had more time, I'll be better. But... Yeah, I think because the trigger wasn't working, I mean, I had to go with the mouse and keyboard. That, that I survived a lot more. I just, if I knew what the button for dodge was, I probably would have been even better. But yeah, this was Mirage Brothers uh, for the demo for it. And like I said, I'll link to the Steam page in the description down below for those that are interested. I don't know how much this is going to be when it comes out, but I mean, if you like on rail shooter, which I mean, this is one. <laughs> and just, I mean, also just because like they're. There aren't a lot. I can't really compare it, right? I mean, unless if, if you recommend some, then I'll definitely try and find time to play those because I do like shoot 'em ups. I do have a lot of shoot 'em ups on my library. I just haven't been around to playing them, and they're all either, like I said earlier, top down or left to right. So side scrolling more or less. So yeah. Anyways, hope you enjoyed it. Until next time. Thank you for watching, and have a nice day.